One thing we've all dreamed of, getting a hold of some of the amazing gadgets that we see in the movies. This is Stuff and we're counting down our picks of the 11 best movie gadgets of all time as voted for by our team. Collecting a TiVo remote that controls the real world from the cinematic god that is Christopher Walken. Yes, please. Having to be Adam Sandler to do it? Uh, not so much. Nevertheless, being able to mute and fast forward everyday annoyances is probably worth it, as demonstrated in the 2006 comedy Click. We're certainly not short on classic movie robots to choose from, but Tars and Case from recent Christopher Nolan Science Fest Interstellar were our editor's favourites. As with many of Nolan's special effects, these robots were actually built in real life and were then tweaked or replaced with CGI during post-production. But remember though, if anyone tells you that they actually understood the ending of Interstellar, then their honesty parameter was probably set to lower than 70%. James Bond and gadgets go together like vodka and martini. While he's probably most famous for his tricked out watches, it was these X-ray shades from The World Is Not Enough that got our vote. And no, it's not just so we can check out people's underwear, it's so we can see into their houses as well. Tony Stark is a man that knows a thing or two about tech. By Captain America Civil War, he's built a total of 46 variants of his iconic exosuit and multiple ways to deploy the armor. The coolest though was his emergency suitcase suit, which he used during the Grand Prix fight in Iron Man 2. How long have we been promised computers with floating screens and gesture controls? Well, Xbox's Kinect came close, but that was used primarily for games and was so unpopular that Microsoft had to ditch it from the Xbox One. Minority Report's computer looks like it would be a perfect interface for video editors though, if what they were editing was the footage of future murders spooled out of the brains of crazy people. Enhance. Stop. Move in. Stop. Blade Runner's Esper Machine isn't the only photo enhancement gadget in the movies, but it is the one that we wish we actually had in real life. Harrison Ford literally looks around the corner in a picture and enhances a reflection to identify his next suspect. Enhance 15 to 23? Give me a hard copy right there. If you thought Pierce Brosnan's X-ray glasses were cool, then Roger Moore's Lotus Esprit is to die for. The British-made 70s supercar doubles as a missile-firing submarine in The Spy Who Loved Me. Elon Musk bought the submarine version of the car in real life called Wet Nelly at auction and has plans to make it a fully working electric road car and submarine. Get away from here you bitch! If you were up against a 20 foot tall alien queen then you'd probably want to be in an exoskeleton forklift machine too, with a flamethrower. In reality though there was a stuntman hiding behind Sigourney Weaver doing all of the puppeteering work. Sorry that's movie magic for you. Do you drink to forget? Well if you ever see any alien goings on you may not need to. Men in Black gave us the Neuralizer, which wipes the subject's short-term memory to be replaced with whatever story the MIB tell them. The only protection is a pair of 1990s Ray-Ban Predators, which by coincidence also look pretty cool. In the runner-up position we have one of the most iconic gadgets ever committed to celluloid. Back to the Future Part 2's tech prediction was the perfectly named Hoverboard, which sadly we still don't have even though we're now past the date the movie was set in. There have been many attempts to make the tech real, but as far as we know, they also don't work on water. And at number one is the movie gadget that the Stuff team wants more than any other in the galaxy. That's right, where would we be without the lightsaber? The elegant weapon for a more civilized age has been on most of our Christmas wish lists since we were a child, and in fact it's probably more lusted after than ever since Kylo Ren's incredibly cool crossguard lightsaber from Star Wars Episode 7, The Force Awakens. That's right, I bet you're making those sounds right about now as well. No? Just me? Okay then. That stuff's top 11 movie gadgets of all time. If you've enjoyed this video and want to see more, subscribe to our channel, follow us on Twitter, and like us on Facebook. 